we have seen a feature that electric field lines try to reduce its length and because of that their source charges are attracted towards each other one side positive one side negative because it start from plus terminate at minus trying to reduce the length it will pull them together that is attraction now how do we explain repulsion on the basis of electric field lines so for that we should know the shape of electric field lines and one principle the principle is that if there are two electric field lines going this way then they always repel each other transversely that means this electric field line will push it this way and this line will push it this way this and this direction is normal so we call that this force is transversal the transversal force and that is why the line become like this this distance is more and this distance is less this is because they don't like each other and they would like to apply a force of repulsion here okay now when we put two positive charges one positive charge here now what will be the direction of electric field lines here answer is this this if i put another electric charge here plus then this will have again going out going out going out going out here going out and here going out yes i understand you will say this is not permissible this is not permissible this cannot happen then what will happen the answer is actually when we see we put a positive charge what we find the positive charge experience a force in this direction in this direction in this direction and it goes like this straight and then this way from here it comes yes this is the field line force what we see actually and they don't intersect here also it happens like this and actually what we find is this and this they become parallel this way okay this is the shape of electric field lines if the two charges are similar now we have seen this principle that if there are two lines parallel to each other they repel each other so here is a force of repulsion here is this force and here is this force of repulsion okay what is the effect of these forces see i tell you one example this is one positive charge these are the lines going out this is one positive charge these are the lines going out and i put them like this if they repel each other this way what is happening to this charge what is happening to this charge if they repel each other they have to move away this way so this shows that these two are getting repelled so why they are getting repelled because these two lines cannot cross each other they repel each other remain at the maximum distance as much as possible as much as they can do as much force they can apply and when they apply this force these two experience a force away and we call it force of repulsion so this is the reason this force of repulsion is the reason that they also experience a force and this is repulsion this is how we explain repulsion with help of lines and the principle is the two lines always repel each other transversally now i will write one sentence for this two field lines repel transversally this explains force of repulsion between two charges and these charges are their source charges now we have seen so many properties of electric field uh, electric field lines so there is one thing electric field
which is represented or shown by electric field lines. We say that electric field lines is only a representation of electric field. In physics, we have one category that if something is real or virtual. So in our next lecture, we will discuss whether electric field is a real quantity or a virtual quantity and whether electric field lines are real or virtual. Are there really lines coming from the charges which attract or which repel or uh, there are no lines as such. Okay, so that we will discuss in the next lecture.